Well, my you name's Grace, and this is my older sister Lily, and we're in a band together called Clues. And I have on Craftsman's, they're my RMs, and you have on suede ones that I gave you. As you can see. Lily and I have pretty much the same size feet. feet yeah. So, um, I'm a bit bigger. I mean, since the dawn of time, I've been getting Lily's hand-me-downs of, like, school uniforms or we anything. We don't even live together anymore, so she didn't have to steal them. No, just, that's true. Well, I already had these. I thought, oh, I'll just be so benevolent and give you Out a of pair. the kindness of her heart. Just so we could be matching. She in thought I was worthy for it. Yeah, I know You know, trying. big honour. So, thanks. That's okay. You're welcome. These were my original. These, like, brown crossings were my OG. So I felt like most emotionally attached to them so I could let go of my, maybe like, you know, is like the second child always loved less or something? That is so rude. <laughs> I'm joking, because oh Grace God. is the baby. Um, no, so yes, yeah, so I had these and then God. I feel like I could part with them. Yes, well, do you know what? This was actually really nice to reflect on because I realised that, so our family has this tradition mm. where um, we didn't grow up on a farm or anything, but like we, once a year, our whole, we're from like a rural area, but not farm farm, you know what I mean? But once a year, our whole family goes and spends like, it's usually Easter or like a long weekend at our friend's like big bush property in Mudgee. And this is like the one pair of shoes that I take every year. They've and been so worn in. we were just talking about with mine, they're pretty pristine, and I think that's because they're suede. I will not let one single drop of rain <laughs> touch these shoes yeah, over my dead true. body. You know, you gotta, yeah, they're like gotta treat them cheese. right. Gotta treat them right. Yeah. They're a perfect gig shoe, actually. We've worn these to a lot of festivals, Where'd you wear stuff those like ones? that. New Year's Eve on the Hill, actually. Oh, we were talking yeah. about that today as well. Yeah. Oh, a very memorable New Year's Eve show that we played a couple of years ago. But they're just, you know, yep, transition seamlessly, day to night. I didn't know that RMs had an in-house service. Yeah, I know. So I, I don't know what you want to do with that information, but I wish obviously Bury that it. I just sent them into RMs. Do you know what I mean? They make you feel, I don't know, like they make me feel like I look like a tough cowgirl or something. Yeah, they so do like have whether a I'm, vibe. So whether I'm walking through a dusty saloon or like across a marble floor, they'll let me, I don't know. They make me feel tough, you know, because they're going to yeah. get you through whatever terrain you're in. Yeah, I concur. I agree. Thanks. You can have those for a while. Yeah, maybe. Until I get my next pair, then I'll pass these down to you. Great. And the cycle will Can't wait. continue. Yeah. Maybe I'll get my own and just distort <gasps> you the dare. natural order of things. I might. What the heck? I know. Yeah. 